to arrive. Here comes the second one. Mind you, it is in. Dozens of students from various schools in Region 4 flocked the Durban Park on Friday morning to capture the firefighters in action and to experience the lifting of the sole hydraulic platform in Guyana. Various companies set up booths in the park displaying a wide variety of fire safety equipment. Divisional officer with responsibility for operations, Gregory Wickham, explained the purpose of the initiative. The purpose of this fair really is to capture a wider uh, cross-section of persons, uh, our students especially, as I reiterate, and the members of the community, that they will come and able to interact with us. We have some firefighting gears and equipment on display that they will able to learn about the use of them also during this exercise. Wickham added that the Guyana Fire Service as part of its recruitment drive will be employing persons at the fair who express interest in the profession. The fire ranks showcased their fitness and prowess by participating in races with their fire gear on. However, spectators were intrigued by the simulation of a burning house, which the firefighters fought rigorously to put out the blaze. Kimberly Giddings, a student of the Richard Ishmael Secondary School, said the initiative by the Guyana Fire Service is laudable since due to the exposure, she was able to learn more. Well, it's very educational because I learned a lot since I'm here about what I didn't know. I learned no today and stuff like that. Probationary firefighter Kevin Maxwell gave his bit of advice to students who are contemplating joining the service. You must be courageous because it's a fire we're dealing with and we all know dangerous fire can be. So you must be courageous, you must be physically fit, right? Because when you have to deal with those hoes and you know have to lift persons, you know, you must be physically fit. And you must have some form of discipline. Fire Prevention Week is being observed under the theme Save Lives, Protect Property and Strive Towards a greener environment. Tamika Rodney reporting for HGP Nightly News.